So first of all, if this is the weight of it, one person is not lifting this and an engine on their own. Okay, so now let's have a look in the bag. Uh, pump feels a bit flimsy to start off with okay this is heavy some poles some rope and an instruction manual. Right. Oh, uh, these must be the seats. Wow, this is big. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna give you an idea of the size of this thing. Okay, for a comparison. Wow. Now I've undone the pump and looking at the pump, it's very plasticky. Uh, seems very well built on here. This pipe here, I would imagine would probably end up breaking. Uh, but I think for a temporary measure, yeah, it's probably a good idea, but maybe from Amazon, I might buy the electric one. Yeah. Solid. This is really, really, look, I mean, you can just push it in. So that's not very good. You put your pump on top of here to pump it, and if you want to undo it, simply unscrew the next bit, I assume, to let the air, yeah, there you go, to let the air out. So three minutes to pump that up, just roughly. Uh, I don't know if you saw during the video, this. So what you do, you line it up on here. I probably put too much air in it to be fair. But yeah, you're supposed to line it up so that this and this are level with each other and that means it's inflated properly. I must admit the, the plastic feels very, very thick. Decided it might be easier to use an electric pump instead. That big boat. Oh my God, it's happening. putting the engine bracket on now uh, so this goes into here obviously and then it goes through here to here this is really difficult to tighten up you can't really get your fingers in there so maybe I'm doing something wrong there uh, have got extension poles uh, which are there and they're gonna go along to there but I think just for today just to take it out I'm going to just do some rowing instead. I worked out the easiest thing to do was to pull this down, push it forwards, and then you can uh, you can tighten it up easier, and then bring it back, and then hook it back in here. I'm not quite an hour in now. I've done the back brackets. I've attached these are ever so fiddly to try and tighten these up. They really are. But um, approximately 45 minutes in so far. This is not really the kind of thing you want to do with just one adult.
first impressions on this um, it's massive it's a lot bigger than I was expecting yes I know you can go on the internet and get the dimensions but I think until you actually physically see it you don't understand it really well built thick plastic definitely enough room for five people uh, I've not put the seats that come in it yet but I will do how easy is it going to get in and out of the water yeah don't know don't even know how to get the actual engine on the back yet but yeah it's good